You are listening and watching to a very special podcast. Here we have more on Silver Eden. Take a look. There was a commotion, all right. Rory Lee had crashed the party. Well, before that, there were a few thugs coming over. And boy, they did not look happy. But Rory Lee managed to hear a break sound, and then the fight broke out. Everyone was in a commotion of a panic. In that panic, Silver backed away, and Barrer lost sight of her during all that chaos. However, Silver ran, and she had to hide. She went into the room, and she tried her best to hide in there to get away from the inspector. She heard the inspector's voice crawling out her name. Silver began to grip onto the door until she heard his voice fading away from sight. Silver sighed. <sighs> okay. Let me see what's going on, she muttered to herself. She turned the knob and she peeked out to see there was a horrid fight going on. Rory Lee was in the lead of letting out the punches and kicks, dodging all the attacks. She was really on a roll. Silver sighed. Wow, she's pretty good, she whispered. Just then, she felt someone put an arm around her clutching at her shoulder. Why, hello there, he said. Silver gasped. <gasps> However, she then felt her vision gone black. When she woke up, she could feel some sort of icy pain in where she had been bitten. She was gasping out. <gasps> oh my God. Ow, that freaking hurt. What the hell? Silver exclaimed. But then when she saw who it was, she felt like a hundred bricks onto her chest. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god, you found me. It's you. You're, you're Benjamin Hallows, Silver said. The young man looked over at her and smiled. The one and only. It's a pleasure to meet you. However, Silver backed away. No, no, keep away from me. Keep away. It's all right, I'm here. Help me, someone. Mm. Silver felt a hand on her, her mouth. Ben told her quietly, shh, it's all right. I'm just here to help you. He dropped his hand. I realize you had that bruise right there. Hmm. I never trusted that inspector. He's quite more of a great of debauchery. He claimed. Uh, that little hickey there. Tricky little hickey. He's quite a little bit of. Never mind. <laughs> Nothing important. Silver looked at what he was doing. Are you trying to heal it? Yes, and I'm also trying to conceal it. Oh, concealer, huh? <laughs> I never knew. I never figured you to be the type into cosmetics, Silver claimed. But no, seriously, how, um, why are you even helping me? Ben looked over at her and said, because I saw what he did to you. It was pretty bad, wasn't it? His hands all over you, his lips caressing, his teeth. Please, I really don't want to talk about this. Silver said, see? You knew what he was doing was wrong, didn't you? Yes, Silver said. 
She felt like some sort of rush between her thighs. She was blushing, but it was a good thing that the room was dark. Otherwise, he would have seen her flustered. Silver had to focus. Why am I thinking about this? No, not that dream again. Why am I still thinking about it? But I can't help it. Silver said. Then she managed to get back into reality. <sighs> ben looked at her awkwardly. Are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, man. You know? Jeez. Uh, it's kind of dark in here. Do you think anyone else will find us? I don't know. Do you want to be found? Yeah, I just have to get back to my friends. I appreciate what you're doing here, but I can't stay. However, Ben looked at her and said, Well, <laughs> I know you can't stay, but... He leaned over and said, Would you like to come with me? Silver exclaimed, What?! That's when, from behind, there was a voice that said, Hurrah! It was you. Silver cried out, You! Wait! Hang on a second! However, Barrer came in, trying to stop you from what happened. However, she saw Benjamin. Ben Hallows? What are you doing to Silver Eden? Ben was trying to explain, as well as Silver. Silver was saying, at the same time as Ben, it's not what you think. It's not what you think. Ben also said, I can explain, please. I I was just trying to help her. Help her? Brewer demanded. What do you mean, help her? Then Brewer noticed there was no wound on her. Brewer then glanced over at Silver, but Silver looked away blushing. Brewer noticed this and looked over at Ben. Something wasn't right. However, there was trouble coming. Silver glanced back at Ben and said, Sorry, I don't think I can, she said, and she rushed out to join the others. Narumi was right beside her. Hey. I heard you scream. Are you okay? He said. I'm fine. Uh, I'm fine. I just... However, Narumi noticed. Hey, the wound is gone. How did you... That Ben guy, he actually helped me. Oh, come on, Narumi said. That guy is nothing more than a psycho. No, he actually helped me out. Uh, I mean, what's so bad about him? <laughs> a lot, Narumi said, but we have to keep moving. The Shinoa squad is heading over in that direction. Horsemen of John are here. Horsemen of John? Oh, damn, that's not good. Silver said. She looked down in pain. Ugh. Is the wound hurting you? No, I don't think these shoes are meant for running. But why am I complaining about running in heels? She clutched onto Narumi's arm and said, Sorry, I know I shouldn't ask you, but don't let me fall, okay? All right, I won't. Come on. <laughs> they managed to witness the horsemen of John making their way through. However, Barrer managed to use Aaron's Titan powers as well as use Zeref powers as well. Silver watched in amazement. The combination of a Zeref and a Titan. Barrer's form as a Titan was like some sort of heaven of archangels. The Titan was huge. It had long hair and wings protruding from its back. This was definitely Barrer. 
Barrer's eyes looked different. They shone brightly, but also she had like pointy horns right on her head. Hair was a flow into the mist, and all of a sudden, Barrer managed to tear apart the horsemen of John. Narumi was shocked. That is impossible, he said. Silver said, only if you believe it is. But that's really what she's all about. Brewer Devlin doesn't give up, and she's not going to bow down into the face of adversary. If she did, what would we be without her? We would be lost. That's why the dearest sleeping beauty, the great Valkyrie Brunhilde, has come to lead everyone into victory, Silver said. Brunhilde? Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to explain more about that. You've been telling me a lot about the Valkyries. I'm willing to know about your side of the story. Narumi said, all will be explained to in time. That I promise, Silver said, giving a little salute. Once it was all over, Silver came over. Bree, are you okay? But Barrer was breathless. She let out a sigh as she said, that was the most amazing experience of my whole life. And it was. However, coming across Ben, the truth came out all thanks to the inspector. It turns out Ben Hallows was the one responsible for the ocean incident. Silver was gasping out, No, no, it can't be. It can't be. She was gasping, No, no, it can't be. It can't be true. It can't be true. It just can't. She claimed. That's when her knees felt like jelly and she fell down right there on her knees. She was in distress. She couldn't believe this was true. She just couldn't. Narumi came towards her side. Silver, he said. This isn't happening. He can't be. He helped me out. How could he be the same guy? Responsible for what happened? Oh my god. Oh my god. I feel... Silver said. Lola came over with Kimizuki. Hey, are you okay? I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Silver was gasping out. Hey, 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 hey. Calm down. Everything's gonna be okay. I promise. She assured her. Silver said. She then grabbed Lola by her shoulders and embraced her. Silver couldn't help herself. She was crying. Lola managed to comfort her. But Silver said something. It may sound incoherent, but only Lola was the only one to hear. Silver was saying in between sobs, <laughs> What did I do to serve myself to love someone like you? Lola looked at her. What? What are you talking about? However, Silver managed to pass out from all the tears. Ah, uh, sad, isn't it? Well, don't worry. We're going to continue where we left off. And I hope you guys enjoy it. See you next time.